we just my wife, like I just crushed all ten, all nine seasons of Suits. Holy shit! <laughs> you know, it's like that's a long one. Yeah, it's like a ten year show. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? And so it's all, and, and they're like sixteen episodes per season, except for epi- season nine. What did I watch? It wasn't. It was a uh, white collar. Yeah. When I had my hernia, I yeah. got I sat through all like six seasons of white collar. Same Doing situation. We'll I think it was it. made by oh, yeah, the same network. I think it was, those were USA shows. USA shows. Because at the time it was white collar, burn notice, which which was another big one. Yeah, uh, I actually worked on burn notice, like a hundred episodes of it. Really? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's pretty that was wild. A long time ago. Yeah, two thousand. 2010. And what did you do uh, for it? ADR supervisor. Just, yeah. So, <laughs> like, uh, talents outside cutting their lines and a plane flies by. Oh, I'd be good at cutting people's lines. So, we, they would come to the studio and we would re, we would redo their lines that they would do out in the wild. Really? Yeah. So, and a lot of that was shot down in, like, Miami. So, like, you got, you know, you got, like, garbage guys. Like, hey, what is that? <laughs> Bet that by up and down. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, like, yeah, so you got, like, you, so you got, like, this, like, asymmetric spy show, you know, with a bunch of sexy characters. In the back, you got, like, bo <laughs> You know? All right. How did uh, you work this one, Ian? You work it this way? This is you work it this way, right? <laughs> that piece needs to bend a little more. Right here, down. Yep. Otherwise, the mic is gonna keep flipping away from you. There you go. Oh, right. got, look see. at that! I mastered it already. Ian. Nah, we'll see. <laughs> oh, wait a second here. <laughs> it is young. The night is young. It is young. All right, all right. I like this one. I just I figured this one. Out. Put this, this one. Nice. Nice. Oh, the guests yeah. have it good here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's cool. moved a little less often, so it it might be just sitting a little tighter. Yeah, on mine all gets, the joints. Mine gets chewed up. Yeah, yeah. We had to rearrange it so that he can. Fit his whole leg on the couch here, otherwise. My phantom limb. Yeah, yeah. (laughs) 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 It works, it works. All right, all right. Eddie, hit it. Welcome to the Sofa Kingdom podcast with your host, Nelson. I'm Ian. Ed. And we have our very special guest today. If you can introduce yourself. Michael. Hi, Mike. All Welcome right. To the show. He said that is the extent in which he is going to talk for the entirety <laughs> of the podcast. So please enjoy that very sexy. Michael. That's all right. That's all right. Just, yeah, the, it's that Barry White tone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, we've had guests that have like uh, they've been on, but they've never actually been here. So we, we, we've had all sorts <laughs> yeah. of things happen. So last week there was this kid that wanted to be on the podcast, and yep. uh, he said, oh, "I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna be there." And then so we planned on it, and then uh, he didn't show up. Yeah, so we, we made fun him. of him the entire podcast. We still shouted <laughs> him out. We had a place set for him, and they put him in there. I'm just impressed at how quick you hit Q that you ran right into it. Yeah. <laughs> I thought like, like I missed a dress rehearsal. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was well, just like it was like you ready? Bam! Yo, this is. I was like, what is happening? Well, well this will be what 111. Yeah, this is our hundred. So, uh, okay. Yeah. A little practice. A little All practice. Right, one, yeah. So okay. Well, I'm honored to be here on well, such a yeah, moment. Yeah, 111. Yes. <laughs> It's a one, very one, special one. One, one, one. I yes, like it. Yes, yes. And, uh, you know, in the beginning, we were doing things a little differently. We were trying to find our way. And then along the path, we were just like, lazy is the way to do it. <laughs> it Zero prep time. It jump right into this shit. We should go do research. It. Yeah, yeah. yeah. have like a fucking tablet. <laughs> and and, and yeah. then then use none of the research. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yes, because that's what would happen is we'd start talking and then go off on a tangent and then... Uh, you would go off on it. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to find that the theme is I get blamed for a lot of shit. Right. You know what okay. I mean? Okay. All right. It's legitimately your fault. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll, bring, we'll have a subject. We'll bring something up and we'll start like, we'll be on that subject. And then all of a sudden, this is whole, Nelson takes a hard left. Like, yeah. Fucking, <laughs> it's called keeping it interesting. That's oh, what right. I do here. All right. right? Okay. okay. All right. See. All right. So speaking of interesting, one show that I have gotten into that I'm loving and Netflix seems to be putting a lot, uh, putting out a lot of these cartoons lately. Yeah. Um, and that's the Blue Eyed Samurai. Yeah, I just started that one. Man, yeah, I it's it fantastic. I know, yeah. I know it came out Friday. I don't yeah. Care. <laughs> I, don't I think I think they they pulled ah, all the content. Awesome. That yeah. They, yeah. Yeah. 
that they yeah. could from uh, India. Mm -hmm. They slapped all those up there. They're like, not working. Quick, well, get some what, anime. Well, that's yeah. what happens when the uh, when the actors and writers strike is going. They're just like, okay, well, let's import every fucking show from Netflix Correct. India and just put <laughs> yeah. it on ours. And on our and interestingly enough, the cartoons, the animation. They're not involved with the actors nope. or the writers. Separate guilds. They are their own thing, so they were not affected. And they're putting out some slamming stuff. Well, yeah, Netflix, they, their original animation stuff is usually really good. Like they have, uh, like they did Arcane, mm -hmm. which I don't know shit about League of Legends, yeah. but the show Arcane was, was awesome. awesome. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, they did Castlevania, which mm -hmm. was awesome because I got into it because I'm a fan of the games. Yeah. And this one, Blue Eyed Samurai. It was so good that I still have not finished the first episode of Invincible because yeah. I don't give a shit. I, yeah. I, wanted to get through the <sighs> I haven't challenge. actually even started Invincible yet. Invincible yeah, is yeah, a good. pleasant surprise. It is. It's, it's fantastic. Good. If you like the boys, yeah. you're going to love Invincible. It, watch the first episode and you'll get the tone of the show and you'll be either well, on loved, board or not. I, lo yeah. I loved all, all, the, all the stuff leading up to that. Yeah. You know, that, you know, just gratuitous violence. Yes. Just, <laughs> oh, yeah. You know, but it's. In, um, Invincible, it's like. Imagine a world where Superman was just a fucking dickhead, right? Mm -hmm. like yeah, if he yeah, was yeah. Just, yeah. Like, but yeah. much more powerful than Homelander in the boys. Like, m like Omni Man is much more powerful. Yeah, than and that was a debate recently, and I was like, it's really not a debate. It's Omni not. Man is like an evil, sadistic Superman from a planet where they kill each other off to see who's well, who the said, top dog. Who, 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 Who's, who argued differently? Oh, there was a lot of articles online of uh, people yeah, trying except to Except for the creators. I believe the creators that came out. Homelander was stronger than Omni. No, I, yeah, I, it's fucking I, dumb. I believe the Omni creator. Omni can like <laughs> fly inter, like he's an interstellar <laughs> being. Yeah. We, li yeah. we live in a world where people argue that, that Batman could kill Superman. So exactly. It's all right. It's all right. Exactly. You know? They always start with, well, what if he had a year of prep? No. Like, what the fuck? No. Now, now, I might live on that camp. Oh, on that. <laughs> Wait, but you're on the Batman side of things? I, I, well, you know. Oh, no. Okay, all right, here we go. <laughs> so I need some pretzels. So we're watching, we're watching, um, we're watching the Batman, mm -hmm. the, like this, this most recent adaptation. Yep. And, my, oh, no, thank you. Mm -hmm. And my son walks in, and I forget what Batman did, but it was like, you know, it was like stupendous, just a lot of violence. But like, I look at Batman the same the, way, the same way I look at like like two hundred forty pound like hockey players, mm -hmm. right? Like they're super agile and graceful, but man, they will fuck you up. Okay. You know, so okay. so something happened, and my son walks in. And he's like, "Oh, how did you do that?" And my wife, who, if you know my wife. She's agnostic to pretty much everything. <laughs> okay, I've been with my wife for fifteen years, or uh, going on going on fourteen years. And uh, sorry, honey. <laughs> yeah, COVID in the cast, but you actually gain more time. Yeah, yeah. But uh, <laughs> but but something. So we're watching the Batman. Some shit goes down in the scene. My son walks in. He goes, "Whoa, how did he do that?" And my wife goes, "Cause he's fucking Batman." Wow. And I was like. <laughs> Right, so it brings up. I had a lot of questions, but 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 my, my, but back to the Batman v Superman. So like, yeah, Superman can just like one punch Batman into oblivion. Yeah, this isn't to say you're you're. I think I think the 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 mix up is people are conflating the the capacity versus the ability, and mm -hmm. I think yeah. mm -hmm. Batman Batman plays the man, right? Right. Right. So like knowing how limited. I mean. Joker had to kill Lois Lane for him to punch through a wall and there and then his chest plate. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. You know, spoiler alert. Mm -hmm. Right, you right. Catch right. that. <laughs> yeah. Right? So like so like outside of that, like I mean, Batman's just he he knows no limits, especially since he's he's taken life. And right. I think like understanding where 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 Superman's boundary lines are mm -hmm. plays to Batman's strengths. It plays to an exploitation and, and then, that he can use. And then the fact, mm -hmm. that, so then coupled that, okay, so then if we take that and you say, well, then that still doesn't matter because this dude can like fly into the sun and come back like roid raged out. So like, what or do you Or just wait 100 years for Batman to Or just wait, oh, yeah, that's it, right? <laughs> just wait him out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, 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 that, so that, sure, and I, and I take that argument right. and I right. say, word, I see that and I raise you the fact that he is mortal, so time is limited. He does break brews and, and, and get broken down. Couple the fact that he's a billionaire mm -hmm. with limitless resources. And like like think about that, dude. Krypton, no moss. 
right? Okay, right. like like you'd be hard pressed to find a new artifact from the Byzantine era that is intelligent enough to make some type of historical context. <laughs> but this motherfucker somehow finds Krypton <laughs> and then weaponizes it more than once. So uh, so again, this isn't this isn't a who could win in a arm wrestling contest. Like I mm -hmm. think anybody who says Batman is superior in that regard it just isn't paying attention. But like. And I know we talked about the samurai show, so we can have to. I don't want to steal this. No, 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 no. We're good. This is better. But, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, but Batman. We'll come back to I it. Think, I think Batman's <laughs> ruthlessness, coupled with how calibrated uh, Superman is, mm -hmm. and then the, the 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 resources available to Batman, when you introduce that element, that is the only thing that brings uh, uh, Superman down to base. Mm -hmm. Now it's a different fucking game, right? And now we're talking about, like, like a trained, like, assassin who feels everything compared right. to some dude that's just kind of strong because he showed up on this side of the universe and the sun just does special <laughs> stuff to him. Like, you know what I mean? But, like, but <laughs> on the other side of things, right, Superman could probably fart and kill Batman. Yeah. But this isn't, <laughs> right? But, 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 but he could. But but I'm not arguing that though. Right. Okay. So 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 yeah yeah. So so on every dimension. So no one credible, I think, is saying that if Superman absolutely wanted to vaporize Batman, that he could. or the planet. Right. Yeah. Because yeah. right. all he could do is he Superman could push the planet off the axis. Yeah. Everybody's dead. Everybody's dead. Right. So planet. like so like the, the argument. Is, remember, it's it's the 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 it's the the he has the uh, the ability to do that. Does he have the capacity? To do that, yeah. and okay. and Batman doesn't have the ability to Superman punch Superman, no, right? right? But boy, he's got the capacity yeah. to fucking break that dude down. And then, uh, how about let me let me let me pose a question a different way? When Superman is exposed to to Kryptonite, right? Who wins in a fight? I well, think. I think. Who's I the better fighter? The better fighter, hands down, is Batman. I don't know about that. When, when exposed to Krypton, what about look, Superman's mastered all, all the martial arts on Krypton though? Torkazim Rao, Torkazim Vo. But have you seen any of those martial arts but, in the but UFC? Batman, <laughs> yeah, but Batman. Have any but of those martial also, arts gone against Brazilian <laughs> jiu-jitsu? Yeah, Batman, <laughs> Batman has also mastered all the martial arts <laughs> on Earth. On, on Earth, Earth which right. means he mastered Aikido, which is useless. So there's a section of the frame. That's He's not really busting out Capoeira exactly. against Superman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and we got it. We got him sitting there and telling Superman to grab his shirt. Okay, here's here's what we have to take into consideration, even. When Superman doesn't have Superman strength, he has farmer man strength. Sure, he does. He grew up he on does. a so, farm. So, right? so, so the Kents put him to work. They, they did. No, Superman no, no. used the Superman's shit out of that illegal alien. But which to your point, wow, fucked wow, up. Hey, wow. which <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> but they did. Oh man, Wait, he's never met Ron DeSantis. I guess. Fucking <laughs> 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 Superman. Yeah, super, <laughs> Superman never would have worked a day in the grove. No, so. Damn right. <laughs> <laughs> to, to your point, that's that's where I've always fallen on this with Superman is it really comes down to Superman has more than enough. He could be miles away. Laser vision. That's a that's a pretty uh, accurate weapon. Lasers. Right. Sure. And vaporize anybody. He doesn't have to be anywhere near Batman right. to kill him. But he's his biggest weakness, holding right. himself back. And that's my point. And, I and think, even when he's okay. fighting people that are destroying the planet, things like Doomsday, he's still holding back. Because right. he's worried about dis destroying everything around him. Yeah. Right. So it really comes down to: Is he going to stop holding back? If he stops holding back, it's it's, it's game over. It's a non. It's right. a non. It's the, we're but not, yeah, but okay. he's he's always you know he's he's the blue boy scout. Right. The whole point is he's stupid powerful and he's constantly holding back to not hurt everybody around him. And that and that is precisely the argument. It's okay. not a matter of of Batman and Superman like legitimately going to right. toe. Right. It's, it's the fact that Batman plays the man. Right. He always has. He always will. Okay. And, 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 and given the combined temperament, resources, training, and just sheer just like – like Batman's a ripe bastard, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> his, there his there kid, have been times where he's gone off on the comic books and has just like beaten people within an inch of their life, yeah. if not killed them, when he loses his temper. And can we just talk about for a reason why? Because his parents died? It's yeah. the pearls. It's, like, the pearl, it's, it's the pearl drop. And like, it's, everybody's always and, talking about the pearls, and it drives him fucking yeah. crazy. And listen, I, as an orphan myself, I don't get it. 
that, that man's a bit of a pessimist. You know? Yeah, like pessimist. I don't, I don't get it. Yeah, you know but you know what, what it is. Like it's... that man, that man's parasite. I get it. I get it. Everyone's got their trauma, but right. like he, he's got a billions of dollars. Yeah, right. go to therapy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and all he does is he, he goes out at night. He hangs out in a cave with a little boy who wears green. Go to talk to somebody. Like, <laughs> Superman's whole species was wiped out. Yeah, he's living in a yeah. place where no one relates to him. He works a job as a reporter. Compare the wage of a billionaire. But to a before reporter. that, he was a farmer. Yeah, and he still has a functional relationship with his adopted parents, mm-hmm. his girlfriend Lois Lane. Yeah, I don't know. That's man. what it is. Batman needed Be a Superman. little hottie. He needed a little hottie in his life. <laughs> Batman had Alfred, right? Oh, yeah. So all right, with this new and information, you know Lois Lane's fucking. She's putting out. Yeah, yeah. Lois Lane is putting yeah. out. Yeah, the, I mean, she's though, a reporter. Though I do think she's an antiquated archetype, especially <laughs> in the movies. All right. Yeah. Okay. If I see this bitch in in can I say bitch? Oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. You can say whatever you like. If I see this bitch. <laughs> Well, that just ended the podcast. Oh, so Thanks for here. joining us, he said. I don't know, yeah. <laughs> no, it's it's okay. got, it's okay. I'm on pay meds, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> the things I've said. Oh, yes. It's, yeah. it's, 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 the, uh, it's, the, uh, it's the Percocets. Uh, if it... <laughs> Yeah, if I see a, dam- a damsel in distress again, it's yeah. just like, oh, and yeah. not that I mind it. Right. I- I'm not, but like, like just right. Okay, but what's worse in the cinematic universe right now? Is it the damsel in distress, which was, like you said, the Multiverse. integrated archetype? Multiverse. Or the new version of every woman superhero can outbeat every mm. man superhero? I hate that more. Right. I mean, I there are powerful <laughs> women, and you should have powerful representations. But when you start, like, every show that comes into it, it's like, here's the genius woman who can beat everybody's ass, and the guy that stands behind her that's, like, getting the call. Like She Hulk? Can you mean the example? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you know, at, least she, at least She Hulk was funny. I think a horrible example of that is the new Star Wars movies. Yes. Ray just being this omnipotent force that mm-hmm. like is just, and then Luke Skywalker is this bumbling idiot that's yeah. sucking blue milk out of the shit <laughs> of an animal on a backwater planet. I was like, he's lost himself. He's I, yeah, no shit. I'm like, he's, when he's been marooned on an island. When yes. did Luke sucking, become a worthless simp? Like, when sucking the fuck celestial milk. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, this fucking sucks. Like, what yeah. the hell? <laughs> well, I don't know. And I ca- think Captain uh, Marvel, I can't even begin. I to, think uh, to uh, the guy that. that played Star Killer said it best about Luke. Um, the guy who laid down his arms to not fight his father, Darth Vader, wouldn't oops and slip up and go to kill a child. Yeah. He, he's more controlled and powerful than that. That's not a thing that should have happened. He shouldn't have become that disillusioned. He was the rebuilding of everything. Right. They, had, they basically unwritten everything they did with his character in the first three movies He's talking about Kylo Ren, right? When he goes to kill Kylo Ren. When he goes to kill Kylo Ren. He's like, that's the thing that should have just never even happened. That's that's Disney's, I don't know, that's the thing they do now. Which, you know what, like from a business sense. The message. From a business sense, though, it doesn't really make sense. Because the, the, like, like the expanded universe stuff, like, writes itself now, right? Yeah. Yeah. You could make. Everything is. Like, Disney's got a hundred years of movies. Yeah. Based on expanded universe. Which Disney has outright said, out of canon, sorry, y'all. Mm-hmm. Which okay, right. cool. You know, I'm not this like di- like? I'm not like you know die on die on. I'm not gonna die, <laughs> die on the hill. hill. They, the they've been slowly they've been slowly bringing yeah. it in, but um, as South Park has finally nicely done with the Pandaverse, they pointed out oh, the crazy. biggest roadblock roadblock has been Kathleen Kennedy, who's outright said she wants to get rid of the original characters and move on from the Force the way it's established, which is makes. When you have a world and you build your world and you set your rules to the world, to throw that all away to rebuild with a new set, it makes no sense. It, it makes everything before it now almost well, is out she, of is canon. Is she talking about bringing new characters in or changing like the laws of physics? Changing the laws of the way the, yeah. the force works and everything. Right. Yeah. yeah. So then, so that'll go well. Yeah. That, so you know, it, it, it's uh, it, it, you know, the best. I think the best short run. That happened to, to the Star Wars franchise was Disney picking it up, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. like in in theory, yeah. And in like these micro bursts, but like over the overarching theme is like it's being viewed as a kid's property, mm-hmm. yeah. Mm-hmm. And they're gonna and they're gonna they're gonna you know weaponize what they know how to do, which is build IP around around product placement and yeah. And, yeah. and 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 all the other kind of consumables that yeah. is, exist in like the Disney princess franchise of shit sure right yeah yeah like well, remember who owns it yeah, yeah. And yeah. right and, but that's well, why like when grogu sorry to cut you off 
came into Sorry. play and so they good. realized, oh my God, everyone loves Grogu. They the just merchandise toys out of and everywhere. Yeah. And they couldn't put them out fast enough. And now when you watch Star Wars, every new character they introduce has either a quirky robot or a, an animal sidekick. <laughs> Now, and and I think them. Rogu fit well. I think if I think for if sure. you, I think if you were to look at like the standard playbook of like Disney's like archetype, like everybody still calls him Baby Yoda. Though. Yeah, I like, know <laughs> that's where they fucked up. They didn't give him a name quick enough. Yeah, like, yeah, I like, agree. And, and, and like I think that's like the best combination. But I just saw um, Ahsoka, and it, it was it was when uh, which was you know I'm sure we'll talk about that. But uh, what was her name? Which they. they she was on the Sabian planet. Ren? She was she was marooned on the planet, mm -hmm. and she had like that like that dog, <laughs> that hyena. Thing. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, right. And yes. she was like, no, and it was like, mm. and it's like it like came off camera and then came back. It's like, dude, this is a wild hyena. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like what are you doing turning your back to this thing, and why has it been neutered immediately? Because like yeah. you showed it its finger. All it knows is snack. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and you know? you're looking like one. And then the indigenous, <laughs> and then those indigenous turtle people. Yeah, there was a lot of things yeah. in that show looking like a snack. Now, I mean, yeah. Now, yeah. and, and oh she's not God. shown for sensitive right. powers with animals, whereas um, what's his name has. So if it was him dealing with the animal, sure. you're like, yeah. That's been his main ability right. is, like, he's had a high connection to animals. Right. She hasn't. Well, it doesn't yeah. make sense for her to have that much of a connection automatically. Well, right. my point was, like, yesterday, my daughter's watching Frozen, mm -hmm. and, and, and the, the, the plucky hero and his horse. Yeah. And I was like, ah, shit, there it is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I've seen this movie before. Yeah, yeah, it yeah, just yeah. doesn't, like, I, you it know. It just like, doesn't track. But Disney does have, and Ian can attest to this, a huge what? track record of outright stealing yeah. another property. Oh, yeah. Kimba. And then, Kimba the White so, Lion. Yes, tell them about Kimba the White Lion. Are you, you know aware of Kimba yet? the White Lion? Okay. So there was an anime slash manga that was in Japan. Like I think it was in the 70s or 80s. Kimba the White Lion. If you look it up, look at the story, look at the artwork, look at the characters, Disney just outright saw it, plagiarized the absolute fuck out of it, and that's how you got the Lion King. Their most beloved animated yeah. Oh, yeah. Almost yeah, frame yeah. for frame Down sometimes. to the birds, down to the monkey, Rafiki, <laughs> down to everything. They literally stole the whole story, credited nobody with it, and cashed in. I love that. Yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I love that. And if you, look, if you look up Kimba the White Lion, the more you look up about it, the angrier you'll become. You're like, my childhood is a lie. <laughs> it's a lie. It's a fucking lie. lie. No, I, I love that because of like, it's like how like under the radar – yeah. Oh, yeah. But back in the day, that oh, was every, that every, was common practice. Oh, yeah. And everybody that's a fan of the Hunger Games, I tell you to look up uh, Battle Royale High School. Look it up. Same thing. Same exact yeah. premise. You know, oh, what, what was that one writer who <laughs> said, like, every good animes. idea has already yep. been had? Yeah. And people are just kind of... But it's okay, because they kind of ripped off the deadliest game, kind of. It's a book from a long time ago, <laughs> yeah. so it's yeah. whatever. Yeah. Everybody rips off something. I mean, they stole comic book ideas from us and then they made manga and anime some countries just blatantly rip it off you ever look at like indian spider-man and superman they're oh my god they're horrific. the best they're the best like, it's kind of like, like the japanese spider-man like uses the stairs and like has a gun yeah. <laughs> i was like all right it's like, like going to the dollar store and you're looking for toys and uh you see men spider it's like this oh yeah this looks <laughs> awfully familiar to someone else I know. I can't quite put my finger on it, but that's exactly what that, you're going to That get. is the thing that's happened with comedians as well, where uh, other countries, other uh, they'll take it, translate it into their language, and just regurgi regurgitate it almost word for word yeah. and play it off as it's theirs because, well, they don't know English in the country here, mm -hmm. really, so I could just take it, play it like it's mine, become a big... Star headliner in my, country. in my country and make money off of just basically translating somebody else's art. It's a good I idea. Yeah, I think that's great. I think it's great. Yeah. <laughs> I, think it's great yeah. I think I think you know there's nothing's new, it's just unseen. Yeah, yeah. that's right. You know what it's I mean? So what like, we should do is we should just learn like Rosetta Stone, like learn another language, like learn learn Vietnamese and then like when a comedian does real well here in the United States, pirate their whole act <laughs> and then just go fly over to there. Vietnam. And do comedy clubs there yeah. and sell out and then just become a success. I mean, or, or to short circuit that, we just like ghost write for like 
a, like a no talent. <laughs> you know what I mean? They got like just in yeah, the they rush. really want to go. It, like they, they, got, they got the gusto, but they don't have the deli- the time, and we just like write all their shit for them. Sounds but, good. You know, then you got to see like how far you can take it. Like first, you start with like a classic, like you know, an Eddie Murphy, delirious, right? You give them that, and like all right. Uh, Pull oh, yeah, that you off. go big. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. yeah. I he, pulled, he pulled that off. Let's... I don't know if that would go well today. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think Eddie Murphy today would So you wouldn't go like canceled. Richard no, you Pryor? Gotta go to, like, you got to go to a country comedy. that's still in like 1998. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's, nope. there's plenty yeah, he, of places it, where their politics are perfect for some of the old Eddie Murphy stuff. Right, mm-hmm. Russia. <laughs> yeah. Well, there's, well there's, also like a, there's also like a time delay, right? Like mm-hmm. I'm prior yep. service. So like my favorite thing would be like, in country and i'd hear a song that like just hit the airways had been out for a decade <laughs> you know what I mean? that was the best you know what i mean i'm over there i'm like singing it like oh you know this song I'm like yeah yeah. <laughs> yeah yeah but you know it's funny because like i work with somebody she's from ecuador and like we'll play american by the way music. i was just mocking a general <laughs> that had, had, had general like i had no one specific point country of origin it's just yeah, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, but so the girl, comment section is like, he doesn't watch anime and he's a racist. <laughs> <laughs> he's in. <laughs> so, yeah, exactly. <laughs> you fall under our demographic. You're fine. Don't worry about yeah. it. <laughs> it's okay. The comment section normally says I'm the anime watching. Yeah, racist, I think so it's fine. <laughs> I think our demographic it's, is, is it because like, you're the only white guy. Are you white? Is that fair? Tell everybody. <laughs> Trying he, to blend in here. He's like the reverse. He's our token white guy, for sure, for sure. So when he has a second one on, they like they buddy it up, man. And it's amazing to see this happen. Token, how am I, how am I, how am I? <laughs> token white guy. <laughs> they start talking about like bologna sandwiches and <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what what the, what is salt salt? <laughs> salt. Are you are you still edging my property? <laughs> Yeah, because last episode we established that he invited me over to cut his lawn. <laughs> and he still hasn't paid me yet. So it's fucked up. <laughs> Wait. The only Latino friends he's got, you know, Wayne he's calling in- over to Wayne, like. Wayne Industries wasn't built today. <laughs> so, 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 uh, you know, I don't, I wouldn't really uh, accuse Puerto Ricans as cutting yard, you know, being like lawn care. Oh. But use? as a white person, <laughs> yeah, most of them can't, Puerto Ricans. they can't they can't establish <laughs> yeah, the difference between yeah. all of the Latinos, yeah. which is what we you were getting at. You need some like roof work done, or like a or car like stolen, a car, yeah, car, <laughs> mobile a mobile car wash detail, yeah. uh, a pig, pig barbecue. Uh, where are your uh, Where are your guys? Uh, you, you, know need, what I mean? you need like a like a clerk <laughs> for like a bodega, <laughs> but like. Like yard work, mm, no, yeah, yeah. No. They don't get their yeah, hands dirty. Yeah. No, 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 no. You would pay me. In and fact, I would, hire I would be else really concerned if, like, like a Puerto Rican's like, "Yo, I can cut your yard." Like, no, no, you can't. <laughs> no, you can't. In you fact, can't do that, man. no. In fact, if you don't leave right now, I'm calling the cops. Yeah, yeah. In fact, stay right there. I'm calling. Even the with one leg, I'd rather cut my own lawn. Yeah, I just let don't you get it. Come you. here and cut my and, lawn and right now. Yeah, it's just, it just doesn't, it just doesn't work that way. So back to the blue eyed samurai. No, I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> That's all. See, this is this is what we're talking about. You yeah, no, no, on no. That. So <laughs> with with the new argument, no I am curious. Puerto Rican's cutting <laughs> no, fuck that. <laughs> so with the, with the new argument in Batman and Superman, has that swayed any of your votes? Because I'm still under the Superman camp, Batman camp over here. Correct. I I, I to be clear, Superman can obliterate Batman. Yeah, but you but, would still but, pick Batman. But uh, but given. Given things staying exactly how they are, mm-hmm. Batman, Batman. Batman takes Superman. What about you? Has, uh, has this I, swayed your mind? Team Superman. There's team too Superman. Many, there's too many ways. Too many options. Uh, I think I still fall where I fell before. Um, well, well, only if Superman is actually genuinely serious. He's 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 too nice. Yeah. So you know, what's so you're, you're playing neutral. You're playing the middle. It, I think I think Superman even at like zero point. Well, I just want to shake power. that down though, because you bring because because you said there's too many variables, and yeah. I think I I, I think. There is one variable that stops Super Batman, which is killing him. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. So, 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 I, I, so I would argue that there are. There's only specifically Batman. There's only one variable, which is death. Right. Then that's not something that Sp- that that Spider Man that Superman is willing to uh, like to like, cross that line. Yeah, I don't think he's willing to cross that line, right? And, mm-hmm. and Batman's hip to that, so he's not going to fuck with Lois Lane. But then 
look at Batman. Batman doesn't kill anybody either. How many people have died as a direct result of Batman just beating the Joker's ass and putting him in Arkham <laughs> Wait, just for him to escape minute. again and murder more people. So, so you know, and so, so Batman can't kill anybody either. So here's here's the irony in that mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Batman be- could play the man, beat Superman's ass by dint of having access to to his only weakness, and which is like renders him fucking useless. Right, not kill him and say like, "I want you to remember this." In fact, that actually that whole sequence actually I believe that happened. does happen. One of the comics, yeah. Batman is like eighty years old. He's in like an exoskeleton. He mm-hmm. has like terminal cancer or something. He's like, "Hey, homie, I just want you to know, like that taste of blood that was from me." And then he like, <laughs> and then they like put him on an iceberg, and he like dies. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I get it. It makes a good comic book. It makes a good story. But I'm just saying, there's no way. It okay. just can't happen. I'm, it can't happen. I'm so then, you. so then, I mean, it's a valid, so then valid argument. This, then. So then, let me ask this: If can we agree, the only thing that would stop Batman would be death. Stop Superman. Uh, 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 yeah, the, the, the only thing that could stop Batman from coming for you is uh, like full blown. You have to kill him. Or yes. break his back. Yeah, yeah. Okay, break his back. All right. Well, but that, but, but, that, but he came back. Yeah, that, he came back. And then, turned, came back. And then that, turned Bane into his yeah, bitch. So that, like, was, that was a that, hiatus. That's going to slow him down, yeah, right. but it's and not going to be a vacation. <laughs> so wait a minute. Bane, Bane did that to him. Wait a minute. And Bane's basically a steroided Mexican wrestler. <laughs> well, well, that's so why here. do we got to go back to the Mexicans, bro? He's a luchador. He's a luchador. And they do yard work. There you go. And I'm Cuban for the... He's racist. I'm Cuban. I just want everybody to know. Okay. I have Latino in the blood. Uh, you, if you smoke a cigar, you can you can taste the sweat off of my Havana thighs. <laughs> so so I just want to go down this thought this thought experiment, and this is really why I've I've I like double down on Batman. So if Batman beating Batman, if Batman's got it in to put a a, a, a Superman away, right? Right. We agree he's not going to kill Superman. Even if he could kill him, he's not going to kill him. Mm-hmm. We agree. No 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 Batman. Even having the ability to kill Superman won't do it. That's that's always a line he's drawn for himself. Okay, so, I yeah. agree. Even Su- in Injustice, in that comic book and video game arc, Batman always chooses to lock him up rather than kill him. Superman, the same, won't kill, right? The, but we we agree the only thing stopping Batman from from coming at you is you got to put him in the ground mm-hmm. or tear his arms and legs off. All right. Right. Now mean, that being said, though, Superman is more than happy. To throw people in negative zone, Hang on. I just remove them essentially from so, the battlefield altogether. So, 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 playing this thought experiment out, it gets to the point where Superman has to kill Batman. Right now, we're and being, vice versa. Well, somebody has to die in this. Someone situation. has to die yeah. in this situation. So now, Superman. Ki- so the argument is, Superman hands down every time, always. Mm-hmm. And yeah. I'm saying is, at what cost? You kill somebody, that's done. Then what? Hmm. I don't know. Does he pack it up and be like, well, fuck it. You chalk it up to the game? Mm. And be like, oh, that was a rough Tuesday. Yeah. I just, I don't know. I just. <laughs> Batman would keep going. <laughs> okay. okay. If Batman there's, wins, there's, there's, Batman there's... would keep going. Yeah. I think uh, Superman, Superman, Superman might bow out. He might hopefully. retire. Yeah. He might, he might he might go to the bottle city of Kandor and, and put on some retirement clothes and, and call it a day. And he's done, right? Mm-hmm. Right? So, like, Batman wins. No. <laughs> he said, "There's just, there's just, Bat. there's just I, levels." That, that, that was clever. That there's was clever. Le- there's Bat. levels. Clever. Clever. So Batman look at, look wins. At the, look at their okay. villains. Look okay. at their villains. It's like the Hawkeye like thing that. with the Avengers. Like it's like the Hawkeye thing with the uh-huh. Avengers. Mm-hmm. Like, you got people with mental illnesses. <laughs> like a guy who wears a scarecrow mask. A guy got burned and have his face is deformed. You got him attacking the city. Okay, fine. Right. Send Batman. Right. But like, if you got fucking Brainiac. Like attacking the Earth with like a whole cybernetic race of creatures, you can't send Batman. No, like ba- Superman could fly through a room with all Batman's villains in it, and I'm counting like fucking Poison Ivy and Snap. Clip, no, and they're done. And they're all dead. <laughs> yeah, no, the force, the force of he wouldn't have to touch them. The force of him flying through the room <laughs> yeah. at light speed would cause the air to expand and shatter their bones. Yeah, but if you put, put Batman in the room with any of Superman's villains, homie ain't walking out. But he ain't walking out. My my, my he ain't he ain't coming out of there. I mean, uh, what's, what's even the, Solomon Grundy? Batman ain't walking out. <laughs> what's what's the one? Uh, he's got the the vision eyes. Uh, dark side. Dark side. Yeah. Dark well, side. That, that was a different it. argument. That, dark that, side. That was one where he he kind of outthought him, and Dark side was like, "Ooh, I respect that. You win." Right. But but that wasn't but he like he still a, could murder him. Yeah. yeah. He he could easily just. Now we're talking. Like, he's super, like he's just like I'm impressed. 
monkey. Are we, are we talking like? Are we talking? <laughs> I will like, let you live. Are we talking That's like different. the new Fifty Two, like old God Dark Side? Because you could put Superman and Batman in a room with him, and that's it. Like it's yeah. You're, it. you're, Dark Side's gonna leave that room. When we he wants did a to. deep dive into, but, but I'm never arguing powers. the abilities. Of yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> what I'm saying is you're that you're trying to win on a technicality. No, very it's cleverly. Not. <laughs> very cleverly. There's hey, a, I mean, there's he's a man. There's, he's, Donald there's a, Trump, <laughs> he's Donald Trump with a Donald, fire belt. I get it. I, there's, there's a lot of resources. On a jet ski with an eagle and a machine gun. Yeah, yeah, what yeah. What I'm saying is there's 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 a psychological aspect here uh-huh. that we're really like like downplaying. Okay, okay. Right? I'll, I'll give you that, but he's still. He's a sad rich boy. At I the end it. of the day, if, if Batman shows up in his, in, in his best Hulkbuster rendition, oh, yeah. Superman could go. Bink to the head. All day. Concussion All day. But, and ba- shatter but, his but brain. consequently, or conversely, Batman shows up and just <laughs> some fucking. Little, <laughs> just just not like, necessarily. Just like an ounce. Not we, necessarily. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? And, you know, I bet you, I bet you, I bet you Clark does coke. <laughs> I bet you, he, I I bet bet you yeah. he's done all of the drugs. I he's probably tried he's the done drugs. That's what I'm saying, drugs. but what are you guys dying on? Yeah, yeah. Fuck. He probably wants he to did. see what people are dealing with. In fact, the fentanyl testing kit stemmed from him. He actually, he's like, I'll take care of this citizen. He's like, you know, he's sitting there to just like stick a probe up his ass and like measure the results. Like, mm, what, what, what's, the, what's the reading on that? The sun. It's the, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that's a hundred percent fentanyl, you know. You know, like that's how they get them. They, okay. You know. I can see that. I can see that. Um, or you just twist Lois Lane. Superman over D- ODs on fentanyl. <laughs> you know, yeah, it's it's just laced with kryptonite, though. Oh uh, man, I bet you Batman doesn't OD on fentanyl. I bet you he'd find some clever way in the Batcave to scientifically make it just as potent as it needs to be without ever killing anyone. You know what I mean? I was watching this comedian, and he was saying he's like. We need to bring back our crackheads. He's like, oh, no, no, it wasn't a comedian. It was Little Boosie. It was Little Boosie. He's a, a rap artist. And he was yeah, saying, he's always oh, yeah. spelling shit. Yeah, yeah. He's, I, I know <laughs> he's always spelling shit. He was like, listen, crackheads live forever. <laughs> he's like, crackheads will fix your car. <laughs> they'll, they'll steal a microwave. Little, little Boosie has taught, has taught more children in the hood to read than hooked on fire. This is true. This Independent, is true. we the best. St- he's always spelling shit. Always. <laughs> I learned how to spell because of little Boosie, so I know. Like, thank you, Boosie, wherever you are. But back to back, you fucking back to the crackheads. They're all in Lake Worth by that fucking escape room. C I'm done. R A. Yeah, exactly. I'm done. C K. Okay. You win. You win. I quit. No, you don't quit. No, I quit. I quit. I quit. So no, we I, need crackheads. I know. Yeah, I, wanna, I know I wanna, what interview you're talking about. Cause this, we get it. He's out. saying he's there was crackheads in his neighborhood for 20, 30 years. They were still alive. Fentanyl came in. One or two hits and they're dropping dead. Yeah. He's like, bring back crack. At least you'll live. <laughs> he's like, That's, he's, that was literally his <laughs> argument. Like, fentanyl, they're dropping dead. At least on crack, you know, they were still around. Well, Get them to fix the car when my, you needed it my, and shit. My favorite are the conspiracies that come that stem from fentanyl, where it's like it's the government trying what, to. What, did the white it. people made it so that the neighborhood housing prices would go up? <laughs> you know, yeah. <laughs> <What? laughs> we would never do anything historically like do that. Do you get yeah, like you an would. email and stuff like that comes out? <laughs> Guys, they, guys, guys, we're passing off. Do they? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, Is it like hey. a? You've got, you've got mail. I'm sure it's, like a, it's, I'm sure it's in the form it's of a like book. The letters club. we used to get about smallpox blankets. Yeah. Sh- hey, I'm by sure. the way, we're giving out smallpox blankets now. I'm sure it's a book club. They're Oof. all subscribed to, and they just come to the house, like, yeah. in the form of, uh, you know, uh, Oprah Winfrey said, "You guys should all read this," you know, because I'm sure she's in on your team. Yeah, she's one of us. Now. On, yeah, she's been on, adopted. Yeah. On the smallpox bit uh, and blankets. <laughs> Uh, so I, I broke my leg on uh, uh, my ankle the Sunday before um, Columbus Day. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So uh, Monday rolls around. I go to I go to Urgy Med. They they z- they scan my leg. They're like, you know, my upper upper fibula is broken. That's a cast. Whatever. Broke the ankle. I need to see an orthopedic surgeon to see if, if they need to do anything for it. Probably so, not, right? They don't even. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, got, yeah, yeah. Two pins, two screws, oh, man. two two, right. two cables. So so. Um, so Monday rolls around. It's a holiday. <laughs> they, I got prescription uh, pain pills, and um, sorry, mom. <laughs> <laughs> right. She's dead anyway. So. Oh, God damn! It's all right, fucking shit. Oh man. Yeah, yeah so I'm saying bat- that's why I don't get Batman. I don't know if our podcast reaches that far. I don't no? <laughs> all right, we'll bring hey, it in. Can you turn it up? All right, we'll bring yeah. it in. So, 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 so I call, I call the the orthopedics. Uh, uh, did, uh, 
some center over here in, in South Florida. Okay, say where we are. Uh oh. Yeah, yeah, you're good. Yeah, you're good. Yeah, yeah. Ain't nobody coming for us. So, <laughs> I, you know, as far as I look at the setup, I'm like, dude, they got a million. They got a million followers. <laughs> so we're working on it. So we are so we're working. There. We're uh, like honestly, mm, you know a the million tel- short. <laughs> yeah. yeah it, it, uh, if the, We're really big in Indonesia. Yeah. Anyway, Finland, yeah, we Finland ki- really fucks we with us. Kill, we kill in Des Moines, <laughs> Iowa. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So 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 I <laughs> so I'm calling I'm calling these places and uh this woman picks up and I was like, Hey, uh high as high as I mean just like a, I was like a stoned test animal. <laughs> okay. And six perks deep. Yeah. And uh, and I'm just a lightweight. Anyway, so I was like, hey, happy Columbus Day. She's like, you mean Indigenous Peoples Day? Yes. And like, <laughs> and like shit, like, it's funny because this has happened to me before when, when I drive through Starbucks and like this woman comes on the intercom and I'm, I'm like, hey, how are you? You know, I, I used to work in retail and fast food in my formative years. And uh, so I'm uh, always like, you know, and I'm just a fucking decent person. Yeah. yeah. So, I'm o- so I'm always like, how are you? How's your day? I love you. Right. So, so anyways, and I'll get to that if you want to know. So, so, so I'm high as shit. She's like, you mean indigenous people's day? And I was like, I broke something. She goes, she goes, she's like, where'd you break? I was like, I gotta go. <laughs> And I just hung up, and then I no shit went to the emergency room of the VA. And you're like, yeah. fuck this, yeah. I'm going right like, over here. Yeah, I was like, I was like, why am I doing this? And then, and then, I, and then I'm gonna show up. You know, you're gonna, you get one look at me, but like, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. But but the other time, there's like ironic that hit me was so I'm at Starbucks and I drive through the drive the drive through. And it's just like, how are you today? You know, it's like, hey, how are you today? And then you say, order my shit. I, you know, and and the person on the intercom is like, that be all. And I said, no, ma'am. And I'm also prior service, so it's kind of like, you know, when I was in, it was no, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, you know, absolutely. Anyway, absolutely. right? You know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> though, though, I, though, if you're listening, if you're a comic in Asia and you need to work on your game. Maybe finding like kind of like inclusive pro military language. <laughs> I'd love to hear those. But uh, but I drive up and this um, this short haired looking fella was clearly a woman, and she was not happy. <laughs> with me. That's yeah. and she like and she read me the riot act. Sounds, <laughs> sounds hot. <laughs> yeah, she read me the riot act, Ugh. and and like listen, man, you know I I don't know what kind of podcast this is, but I don't give a fuck. Whatever you want to do, that's yeah, cool. Like yeah, yeah. like like, but like also. Uh, Big Disney fan. Uh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> right? And like, and like, she's reading me the riot act, and I was like, I was like, listen, you, I, I don't know what kind of how, like what you're trying to game here, but like, yeah, like I am sorry. Can I please have my coffee? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Can I just get my coffee? Like I spoke to you through a box. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but now something similar to this, but worse happened, Eddie, with the GameStop. I love that. What was that? Is that but then they died. Oh, the big, the big muscle dude. The no, muscle dude uh, that was intentionally damn. looking to start shit be- no, with employees. No, no, don't get me wrong, right? It's, it's, it's ma'am. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes. yeah. Fuck, it's yeah. like what the fuck? Well, don't get me twisted. Like if the next day, and we'll play the what if machine. If I walk into that Starbucks and that person's there like I like I just I'm hit to it I'm right like, like right. word but like 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 you have to also understand that you're talking to me through a box sure you talk hey everybody <laughs> on the podcast <laughs> right <laughs> what do I sound like yeah <laughs> you know what I mean yeah like give g- give me a chance to like just like correct. catch up not yeah. even correct be like yeah. just like, oh, hey, my dude, you know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. My no, name's no. Steve. Like, word. <laughs> cool, Steve. Yeah. Have but, a nice fucking day. But, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I don't care, but, like, don't give me shit. So, so, yeah. fast, f- and this was, this was like, there, six there, years It's a level ago. of, like, you know how you sound. Right. You especially know how you sound through this awful speaker. Correct. If I've and made correct. a mistake, how about a little grace? Well, and, and I think, you know, and I say that to say this, I think, I think like when we talk about like this new, uh, this new era of writing as it, as it pertains to shows, particularly on Disney. But or how about you don't put the gender fluid cyberpunk on the fucking microphone? <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right. Or if you know you're going to be a gender fluid cyberpunk, like he's saying, you should 
give a little bit of leeway. Just have a little armor on you. How about you put yeah. the foam on the lattes that day and give the fucking intercom <laughs> to somebody, you know, somebody who's A or B. How about that? I'm just saying. You know, you no, know? but when when it happened to the GameStop, I wish it was an imposing. Me through a goddamn it was an imposing sized <laughs> it was, man. No, no, no. It was woman. at the window. I wish. I fucking the, wish. It was at the I window. pray to God above that I fucking order coffee <laughs> and someone starts reading me the fucking riot. Act. God bless you for being a good person. Well, I, I was, I was like blown away. Yeah. I was, I was really so two, so two things happened. The I first, hate Roseanne's son. The <laughs> first, my fucking coffee. The first thing, the first thing that happened, the first thing that came to my mind was like. Like, I, the first thing across my mind is like, I have no idea what the fuck's going on. Uh-huh. <laughs> like, I feel like I entered a conversation. Well, you I, thought like, you were polite. You're going to a very progressive coffee mm-hmm. place in the first fucking place. Uh-huh. And then you're getting harassed in the window <laughs> because, oh, because the fucking creature behind the intercom identifies as something you did not direct them through to the electric box. What the fuck is this? Well, and, and, what are we doing and here? Then, and then the second, the second, the second thought that came through. So I, once I realized, I'll never run for office. I say this shit all the time. Like, I <laughs> feel like, like, like you ever like, you ever like been in a car accident and you're like, what the fuck just happened? And you're like, you're all shook up. And yeah. you're like, oh, where? Oh my God. Thought, right. Right? Like yeah. that's what happens. So it's like, she's yelling at me and I'm like, I'm, just, I'm thinking like, what the fuck is going on? And then it connects. It's like, oh, you're the bitch on the bar. Oh, <laughs> yes. And then my next thought was like, oh, my God. I told you to shut the fuck up. Because <laughs> there's no resolution. Yeah, no. And yeah. you're not going to win that argument because there's no there's And I no apologize. I, I was like, hey, I'm sorry. Yeah. Can I have my coffee? Yeah. yeah. And that should be enough, but most people, they don't want to let that go. They want to keep and, fucking... Yeah, and that's why I was saying, like, with that whole GameStop thing, is that this person was an imposing man slash woman who decided I'm going to abuse the shit out of it this person. It was fucking for Gary no Busey in a wig. Those I mean, are my favorite. No, those, no. those are my favorite, though. <laughs> yeah. yeah, those those are my. Gary favorite. Busey's amazing. As oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, come on. Have you seen the fucking the deep fakes of Gary Busey though? <laughs> I have not. Oh, um, the, the, it the thing is, Busey but, is so out there that you're like, mm, plausibly legit. It. Yeah. <laughs> So that's a real thing. So there's, so there's, so there's a. a I'm pretty sure it's a deep fake. Uh, uh, um, He's that pretty sure. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. he he. Admit, it's him a- talking about like 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 jelly. <laughs> He's a great actor, but he would make a terrible woman. Uh, yes. Same with William Defoe. If you've seen uh, Boondock Saints, right? So, but who's worse? <laughs> the then? ugliest is, hooker ever. Is it, is it Gary Busey or Britney Spears? Who is more on the deep end right now? Gary yeah, well, Busey. Gary's been on the deep end yeah, ever no, since no, the no, accident. Yeah, yeah, that dude's been on the fringes yeah. of sanity yeah. Has for a he while, did a man. dance with butcher knives in his yeah, kitchen? No, no, no. Listen, 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 if there are actual Lovecraftian gods, Gary Busey has spoken to them. All he knows them. They know Gary. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, he is one of them. One, one of them yeah. owes him money. <laughs> one yeah. Of the, yeah. yeah, but yeah, yeah. I would say yeah. Gary, Busey, Gary Busey plays Skyrim and only does the Hermaeus Mora missions. He goes deep into the You know what kills me about Britney Spears is that... We're like publicly like we're publicly like rooting for a mentally ill person. Oh no, yeah. I I, oh, yeah. I applaud when she does the craziest shit because remember years ago when everyone was like free Britney? All right, you let her out. Yeah. This yeah. is Britney. Yeah. Enjoy. Yeah, and, it's you know, like and where are all those I... people who now know, god damn, she does need Yeah, she's help. fucking nut, oh. right? Oh, I love it's it. Like when, yeah. It's like I, when Kanye I, when Kanye said that shit on that podcast. I don't know specifically what he said. And, and, I, and, and I, Alex and, Jones was like the voice of reason. And I'm yeah. sure. And I'm sure. And yeah. I'm sure what he said was irrehensible or irre- 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 reprehensible. Reprehensible. We can't right? even say that word here. So right. <laughs> right. Like, like you know, but we're also letting a sick person yeah. talk. Like talk. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And like, and and then and then it's like, oh, look what he said. But like, and like, and like, two things can exist at the same time. Like, he said something anti-Semitic, which is wrong, and we're letting that motherfucker go on like high-profile. Like, like, you know, easily a million yeah. per people heard that that that, yeah. that podcast live, like as yeah. it went down. Yeah, and we're going back to our tribes and like, you believe him? Bop. I'm like, yeah, yeah, that was dumb, and you should like that dude should be talking to a shrink, not yeah. a not. We we all know not he on has the breakfast club. We all yeah. know right. he has problems. <laughs> We've known he's had problems for over a decade. So there is a point of exploitation right. of a mentally ill oh, person absolutely. on these things. So, Eddie, so I, I would like to apologize to you <laughs> for all the podcasts that we've had you on. <laughs> I just, and I, we don't I, condone anti-Semitic. <laughs> <laughs> no, we definitely we don't. don't. We, we definitely don't. don't. But I mean, he gave him way too, he way way too many off ramps, and just be like, "Whoo, all right." 
At least. I guess they're on that train. That was you. Hey, whoa, hey, whoa, hey, what the fuck are you doing here? What the hell? What just happened live on the no. oh, 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 you're making it worse. <laughs> you're fucking making it worse. Oh, yeah. Hold on, I was trying to this fix is, it. No. No, I was hey, trying to fix don't it. You, this don't you, don't it's you, good. Don't it's you good. always <laughs> drop the Yo, fruit? Give me that what shit. did I say, Mike? I said it was a matter of fucking time. Yeah, give me that I am doing nothing. <laughs> All right, what's happening here is full, full, uh, full. everything oh, has oh. just fell down into my lap. So there's... <laughs> This is, he's digging is this, grapes. Is this, is this the first time you've had a pile of fruit on your nuts? He's, digging, he's digging grapes <laughs> at his ass. Don't move. I don't even just know stay there. Stay, stay where this, the fuck you are. We'll fix it. Bring this back. We'll fix it after the. As a matter of fact, can we talk about actually, the pandemic gonna... of Latin men having no. grossly yellow legs? Like, what is going on? We gotta go. We gotta go do more yard work. The seat keeps continuing this, to go further yeah. back. This will never happen. This will never happen on a Mexican podcast. <laughs> Yeah, they would have had to shift so, fix a long so time full, ago. Full disclosure. <laughs> wait, wait. I'll tell you. I want. I want everybody to understand what just happened. Um, I've, uh, I've been elevating this foot for like a month, right? Mm. And I felt a lever, so just out of like habit, I was like, oh, I'm gonna elevate my foot. <laughs> and, I, and I, I and shot you. And I totally <laughs> fucked. <laughs> yeah, it's all right. I'm, I'm with it. You got it. But, what, what you we might as well get comfy. There you go, man. All right. There we go. I feel like I feel like this is hey, this is a lot better. Why the fuck don't we do this whole thing? I don't know, man. Oh, word. This is the first time. Oh, yeah. No, yeah. We appreciate it. Wait a minute. You might have just changed the game, Mike. Yeah. Hold on. I'll, uh, we've we've spilled coffee on I'm here open, before. I'm open to come back if you have me. Yo, bro. <laughs> yeah. We might have to have them back. We can have blankets and shit. This is like a fucking. We can have a slumber party. This is fucking great. Yeah. Yeah. So I felt the lever and I was like, oh. Oh, yeah, relief. Yeah. <laughs> so this is how like big experiments happen. This is how like light, you know. I'm comfy. Electricity is created. This, yeah, this yeah, is big. yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm loving that. Sometimes I'm the boy. Sometimes you're the boy. <laughs> and sometimes that person at the window at Starbucks is both. Man. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what's most upsetting about that? What's really most upsetting about this is that there's a lack of like internal peace that they walk around with, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. And, like, and like walking around, right, wrong, or indifferent, right? And I'm sure there's a level of like environmental shit that's influenced their sure. perception and the lens they looked at the world through, and like like the ele- the level of peace or lack of peace that they probably walk around with, oh yeah, like, kills me. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Like I can't imagine. It's like Star Wars fans. Like we get like we like we're miserable. Yeah. Right? Star Trek fans too. They're, you know, no, Star not... Trek fans are genuinely happy. Yeah, they're solid guys. They don't fucking yeah, yeah, go after their own genre. The I'm way not. That Star to be clear, Wars I did not a Star Trek fan. Same. He's wearing Trekkie <laughs> underwear. I'm, I'm, get, I'm, not, wear, I'm not wearing any underwear. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what's worse. It makes it. it uh, well, I, going to the bathroom's a bitch. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so if I gotta pull down two pieces of garment versus one, like I'm opting for this. The He's c- teaching us so many things. Put the recliner up and no pants. That's no, the same. No underpants. That's the yeah. same reason I don't wipe. It's too much. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> sit, sit when you pee, fellas. That's what oh, that God. is. Be yeah. a man. That's yeah. what that is. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, uh, <laughs> sit where you pee. I don't know. On, Shit when I first pee? got out of the. Uh, the ER uh, for my abdominal surgery for the hernia, and I'm laying in I've the never bed. heard of a belly button hernia, by the way. When you told me that, I thought you were lying to me. Yeah, crazy, right? Yeah, you're like, my, I got a hernia in my belly button. I was like, I'm pretty sure you made that up. <laughs> <laughs> he just wanted to get out of training. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah like, exactly. And I just, yeah. I, just picked up, I just picked up purple belt, too. I'm like, yo, you, what's up? You want to go? He's like, oh, I got a hernia. Yeah, <laughs> going to be out like a year, but, uh. <laughs> you know. So it's got a belly button. I get I get I'm out of the anesthesia. I'm still fucking groggy. I'm laying there, and the nurse that comes over to me after the first asshole leaves was like, "You gotta use the bathroom." I'm like, "Absolutely do." I was like, "I need help to the bathroom." She's like, "Yeah, yeah." She, I'm in a lot of pain. I can barely stand on my own. So she helps me up, and she goes to me, "Would you like to sit or stand?" And I'm like, thinking to myself, "I'm a fucking man. I'm, <laughs> I'm a stand and piss." <laughs> Thank you. Close the door, right? She closed the door, and like I start peeing. I'm like, "Fuck! I should have sat." <laughs> Absolutely should have said. You sit every time. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You, sit, yeah. you sit every Fuck. time. I should have I should have thought to myself, if she's asking me this question, she knows, hey, you should no, you, sit. You gotta sit. You gotta Holy sit. Holy shit. I, I started sitting at the age of thirteen. I did hockey and I was a goalie and it was just so much easier. <laughs> On the ice or did you No no in the in the latrine. In oh, the okay, all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
But like downloading all the gear, it's like just fucking sit. Yeah, no, he he used to play goalie. I played yeah. center uh, for a while there, yeah. and there is a shit ton of equipment to take off. Yeah, it was just like like there's not there's more like the business end is up front. Yeah, and I re- oh, yeah. like 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 after like six months into it, I was like, I'm just sitting. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Even yeah, yeah. the jock strap is designed to it's like back exposure. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, you know yeah. what I mean? It's just, it's just like it just screams just like sit. <laughs> you know every uh every poo poo time is pee pee time. But not every pee pee time, time is poo poo time, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, my my what the fuck? My, this my, is some doctor shit. My wife. <laughs> my wife has a similar anecdote for cocaine and drugs. And, and oh drinking, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh uh not every cocaine time is drinking time, but every drinking time is cocaine. Time. <laughs> <laughs> and on that note, thank you for joining us at the Sofa Kingdom podcast. Huh. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> You can find us on all your social media platforms at Sofa Kingdom OFC. You can find us on YouTube at Sofa Kingdom Podcast. Ian, take us away. Listen, uh, put us in corporate emails, send us around, make flyers, stick us places, tell your friends about us. Uh, We're like fentanyl. We're everywhere. Goddamn right. And thank you for joining us today. We really did appreciate it. We'll definitely have you back to screw up the set one more time with uh, pulling levers. He's like, is that a button? I I like it. I like it. It was a lever. It was a lot to commit. It was no, like, you had to commit. You yeah, did. it was like it was like rap, pull, watch. <laughs> I'm down for this. This is actually great. Uh, we'll see how it turned out. But I mean, uh, speaking of fentanyl, uh, a bunch of the uh, the drug uh, main guys down in Mexico, information started leaking out that they are trying to remove it from being used in the cut because too many customers are dying. That's bad for business. It's you can't bad have that. for business. You can't yeah, have that. yeah. What like was the we, show we started with? The Blue Eye Samurai? Blue Eye Samurai. Yeah. Right. It's fantastic. <laughs> so now you see how the show runs. No, it's cool. <laughs> we just go. Oh, oh my God. Um, Ed, I cut out my audio by accident. How'd you do that? Um, that one is not going to be connected to the one that's on the mic. There was a loose cable that was replaced because that one that connects there was bad. All right, so it's back here. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's probably on the floor now. You ain't reaching that. It's not a chance. I doubt you. This is me fully doubting your abilities. This is all on camera. (laughs) 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 This is the shit that happens behind the scenes. Is the most talking I'll probably do too. No, 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 don't worry about you it. You know what's funny is <laughs> that's that's the same way Nelson disconnected his headphones the last time and then blamed it on me not working when he was the one that fucked up the cable. Ah, uh, yeah, because I'm not going to take the blame. It's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> well, no, it's it's okay because we got you on camera this time. No, no, no. Fucking it up. I'll delete it. I'll delete it. <laughs>